episode one of my big battery storage project. And before we get going, I'd just like to explain I won't be using Pylon Tech batteries, but I will be using a vehicle to load car, along with my existing Tesla power wall and my hot water cylinder heating, along with some more batteries on the Victron Quattro inverter, which I'm installing. The Quattro will be going on the wall next to my Tesla power wall. And there it is mounted. I've mounted it um, at the beginning of December and added some trunking. So this is just getting all the hardware into position. I have also connected it to the laptop, which it, all I've done so far is actually used it to disable the car, the battery charger and also set the parameters for the um, UK DNO. I've also set up um, the 8 to 2 AC inputs. One will be a 50 amp on AC2, which will be the mains, and AC1 will be used as the um, vehicle to load, which will only be 10 amps at the moment. As of the 5th of December, I have added the AC load in and also the AC load back out. So that's back to the consumer unit. So the Victron inverter is just working through pass mode at the moment in preparation for getting the internal batteries in. The internal batteries will just be a 48 volt AGM leisure battery type. And these are literally just as a buffer to help out the vehicle to load because that'll only be 10 amps. Thanks for watching this introduction to my vehicle to load project or big battery project. If you've got any questions or comments, please add it to the section below and please like and subscribe.